Yo, what's going on guys? Your boy Caesar here and welcome to another video on FIFA 20 Ultimate Team. Big welcome to the channel, hope you're all having an awesome day. Today's video then, we're going to be giving a review with some gameplay for the new shapeshifter Henrik Mkhitaryan. He is a cam, he is 88 rated and he is uh, obviously from Roma. So... Looking at him then, 5'10", high medium, which is perfect for me for a cam. 4-star skill moves with the 5-star weak foot. So left foot, left foot shots, right foot shots. He should be getting them at least on target. So his pace is good. He is obviously on 10 cam. I am going to be rocking a maestro on him, guys. I do want a uh, boost for his all-round like game, if that makes sense. But straight away, his strength is a little bit on the low side. So he is probably going to get bodied off the ball a little bit. But it'll be interesting to see. So the maestro then boosts his shooting, his passing and his dribbling. So the key stats for me is agility is boosted uh, his balance is boosted, his reactions, his ball control, his dribbling, I mean, they're all, they're all right up there in the 90s as well, so that's key for me, his short passing at 99, so his passing should be crisp, um, his long passing looks pretty decent as well, uh, so this is the team, the custom tactics then I am going to be rocking, I'm going to be going with the 4-2-3-1, pressure on heavy touch, whip we've got on 5, Depth, we've got on four. The offensive style, we have got on balanced four for the whip for players in the box with two on corners and three kicks. Players then, Chiesa is going to be our striker. Mkhitaryan is going to be the number 10. Palatano right, Felipe Anderson left. Pep and Pearl in the middle. And then Tierney, Hero, Bobby Moore, Trent and Courtois. Uh, as you guys well know by now, come back on defence for the front four. Uh, the front four. Default everything else. Cover centre would stay back while attacking on the two CDMs. And then stay back while attacking on the back four. And the keeper is going to be on a sweeper keeper so that is the team that is uh, the position i'm going to be playing mkhitaryan in the number 10 so just make sure everyone's on full full fitnesses and no contracts are needed so everything's fine let's jump into a game so our opponent then he's got lacazette up front kingsley coleman uh, mbappe matuidi um sissoko dembele mcquite hernandez Lengle, uh, Rousselon and uh, Hugo Lloris. It looks like he's going for the, the, the French challenge there. So, straight away, testing out his long passing. Look at that crisp right at the end of his feet. So, I'm, I'm happy with that one. Now, look, he, he does get he, do, he gets the ball back, but see what I mean about him getting bodied a little bit. Um, once again there, a little bit, little bit bodied off the ball. So, his strength definitely is, is a little bit of an issue, just for what I'm seeing so far. But... Look at that, over the little little dink over the top. We're gonna give it to him back. Little uh, try and do a little drag back, but then Glade gets in the way as well. So picking the ball back over them then. Free ball down the wing to uh, Felipe Anderson. Now if you notice the free ball was right in front of Felipe Anderson, so he could run onto it, so I was happy with that one. Cause uh, 'cause normally it's just to the feet. But going in front of him it gives Felipe Anderson the opportunity to um to run onto it and create something so once again look at this dribbling guys everything is very very close to his feet which uh, which I like the feel of as well and he, he's ready waiting for the ball back now we're going to test out his left foot here keeper pulls off the save but see what he's his, his dribbling is insane like his passing is really good as well from what I've noticed so far but we're going to test them out on the corner let's put the near post cross in and um, hero look at that so he's picking up an assist already guys the pass right into hero's head near post hero is dominant when it comes to near post finishes you anyone who's got hero will know um but yeah just uh, from our opponent our opponents about to about to rage quit i do believe uh, i think he's had enough already yeah so we do pick up we do pick up the rage quit but as you can see with um Mkhitaryan there is dribbling, is passing, he's ready to go again, his one twos and his left foot shot as well. So the five star weak foot coming into clutch. We're gonna we are can end the gameplay like that, so we're gonna look for another opponent guys and let's see what our next opponent's got. So 
He's got Perisic, Sanchez, Awa, Kante, Dembele, uh, Son. He's got Florenzi, Lengle, Varane, Testegen and Rousselon at left back again. So let's get into our second bit of gameplay and let's see what he's got. So ball with Tierney. Look, at, look who's there in the middle waiting for the ball, Mkhitaryan. Lovely pass right into Keza and look he's ready to go again. So do a little bit of skill there and the ball. See how close the ball sticks to his body. Look at this. See what I mean? Like no one no one can just get no one can get near him. No one can absolutely get near him. Little uh, look at this. <laughs> what, what a guy. What a player this is guys. What a player. Yeah, I'm not really a Mkhitaryan fan, but just just on what I've been playing so far, he is absolutely insane. Now, I thought we were going to get another rage quit there, but thankfully we didn't. So, pass down to Tierney then. His passing is insane. And then we're going to test out his long passing again. I know it's to the centre-back, but still. Um, ball back into Mkhitaryan, bit of skill. We try and do the ball roll, he gets bodied a little bit again. But he gets the ball back, and then he gets bodied again, guys. So, the strength is definitely coming into play a little bit there. Now we're lucky, lucky enough to keep hold of the ball there, our opponent loses it a little bit, but a little bit, a little bit scruffy in the middle. Our opponent's trying to attack, but we do get the ball back with Pep Guardiola. Now look at the run, he's meant to be playing cam guys, and look, he's further ahead of Chiesa there. So he's, he's interchanging with Chiesa, which I like to see. So, pick the ball up with Palatano, get the ball to Mkhitaryan, and look at the... <laughs> His dribbling, guys, is absolutely insane. I don't know whether it's because of the maestro or or what, but the ball just uh, like sticks to his feet. It literally feels like it's glued to his foot. Now, look, he's making the run again. He's there. He's, he's free. We try and get the shot off there with uh, with Flip Anderson, but we do get the ball took off us, and our opponent goes on the attack. So, Politano picking up the ball, goes out wide to Trent. And now we're going in the middle, and look who's there again in the middle, waiting for the ball. And a lovely free ball to Keza. Little uh, little finish into the near post with his right foot. <laughs> yeah, so he's banging the assists, he's banging in the goals. What else can we say about Mkhitaryan apart from his strength? I'm not noticing anything bad apart from his strength. Everything seems to be on point so far, so fingers crossed it carries on. So... We go 2 0 up, we pick the ball back up with Mkhitaryan, we, we take it past one there and then give it to Pep Guardiola. Now we're looking for him again, now he picks the ball up, little drag back, ball into Felipe Anderson, he gets the ball back, see what I mean about the gives and goes, like I'm not even pressing the L1 button to make him run, he's just doing that by himself and I'm, I'm actually loving that, I like the way he does that. So he seems to always be free as well. So our opponent is uh, going on the attack with Sanchez. Nothing comes of it, but he does get a corner from that. Now we defend the corner. Now let's test out Mkhitaryan's pace. He's going up against Awa here, so Awa's not a slouch. But look at this. Gets us right up the pitch. Now he does get bodied again, guys, but we are lucky enough to get the ball back with him. And look at this. He's ready to go again. A little drag back. A little bit of skill. He wants it back. There he goes, fake shot, and we get the shot off. Goes out for a corner, and our opponent is pausing it again. And he has had enough, I do believe, yeah. So, two rage quits in two games with Mkhitaryan. He did pick up the 9.0, um, so that's man of the match. I know the game hasn't finished, but man of the match for me. Um, and I think that was only in like 30 minutes of uh, game time, I do believe. So, that's really good. Goals, he picked up one, as you've seen. Uh, assist as well, yeah. He picked up the assist for Chiesa. Two out of two shots on target. 11 out of 11 passes completed. Dribbles wasn't quite up there, but tackles, he, he did actually win the tackle as well. So, saves and fitnesses is irrelevant. Now, we do have a game left with Mkhitaryan, so I am going to try him out for the challenge that I am doing at the minute. Uh, but, the maestro... Um, I'm happy with the maestro, I am going to stick with the maestro, but you could also try a hunter with him, you could try a hawk, you could try a sniper, a dead eye, 
to um, improve his, his passing even more. But for me, I just wanted him, I thought his pace was enough on its own. So I went with the shooting, the passing, and the dribbling. I mean, you could also rock the the maximum on him to boost up the the the, the physicals a bit more. Because his strength definitely is a little bit of a problem. But he's that good. He should the way he gives and goes. If you notice, then in the gameplay, if you play right with him. He shouldn't get bodied off the ball that much. But, yeah, <laughs> what a card. I I, actually, I watched Tyan Alters alone for the review, but I think I am definitely going to go and complete his SBC. I think there's there's a few days left on him. So, my opinion, guys, go and pick him up, especially if you have a Serie A team or you've got a few icon midfielders, you can, transfer, um, you can convert him to a striker or you can somehow get him in. Go and do it, guys. You won't regret it. Uh, but that is today's video coming to a close guys, I hope you have enjoyed, if you have, leave a thumbs up for me on the video, that'd be very much appreciated, and if you're new to the channel, hit the sub button with the bell so you never miss an upload, all that good stuff guys, that'd be much appreciated as well, that'd be awesome. Um, but yeah, today's video is uh, is finishing now, thank you for watching, take care of yourselves, um, yeah, go and pick them up, please go and do it, and I'll catch you in the next video, take care of yourselves, have a nice day, bye bye for now. Peace.